this is the Enkai Hotel. My Thai translation is not perfect, but I think Enkai means something like relax or just sort of flop down on the beach. And you can certainly do that here. Come inside and have a look. So first of all, you need to get yourself down to Bali High Pier in Pattaya, but then it doesn't really matter if you come by ferry and the timetable is on the screen now, 30 baht each way, or whether you pay about 150 baht for a speedboat, you need to come over to Tawan Beach. That's the nearest to the hotel that I'm going to show you. But even if you go to Naban, you can still get a Songtel over to the other side of the island, and that's going to cost you an additional 30 baht. From there you can walk to the hotel in about 10 or 15 minutes. That's what I did and when I got there they told me well actually we will send a golf buggy to come and pick you up for free. So after that unnecessary walk I really appreciated the butterfly pea cold drink and they do request payment in advance or they did when they took one look at me and one thing to note is that you can't scan the payment you have to transfer from your bank account to their bank account I guess you could also pay by cash and then there aren't any lifts in this hotel and I was on the first floor so it was a trip up the stairs but it was well worth it when I saw the room so this is a room that has got a real wow factor when you open the door. Just look at that view and I love the fact that they put the bed in the middle of the room so that you can lie on the bed and look out at the sea view to your heart's content. Of course the sheets, pillowcases and towels are top quality. You've got the air con there. You've got a large size flat screen TV which is wonderful. The decor is lovely and white and modern. Can you see those fake books in the bookcase there? You've got some water, a safety deposit box, and all of those snacks in the tray are actually complimentary, which is nice. Plenty of switches, including a row on the back of the bed. Nice thick curtains to keep out the light, and then out onto the large balcony. And what a view that is of the turquoise blue sea, the swimming pool, the beach, and the eating area. The bathroom, I thought maybe that needs a bit of a spruce up and I do have to say that both in the evening and the following day there was no hot water coming out of my shower, which certainly gave me a shock. Other than that, the shower was powerful and it was spotlessly clean. The hotel does have its own beach and lounges and of course you can order a drink or something to eat and they'll bring it to your seat. I enjoyed a nice non-alcoholic cocktail. And the hotel also has its own motorbikes and a restaurant where you can take lunch or dinner. One of the good things about staying at the Enkai Hotel is they include motorbike rental in with your deal. So I know it's only like 100, 200 baht if you buy from a shop, but for this one, when you need a motorbike, go to reception, they give you a key and off you go and you can go far from the madding crowds. So it only takes a second or two to drive over to Taran Beach and then if you know that area up the steep hill and you'll be very soon at the viewpoint. This is where everyone comes to take a selfie or take a picture of the sea. It is absolutely beautiful. It's a little bit hazy with the PM 2.5 today but nevertheless the sea is a beautiful colour. You can see all the activity from the boats coming in and going out and it's a very pleasant place to spend a few minutes. And from there you can explore the rest of the island. I went back and relaxed at the hotel and ventured out again in the evening because as I said if you're staying overnight Kolan does have a different vibe and it's quite quiet so I chose to eat something at the hotel and then head out for the evening. You can find many places nearby that are basically restaurants and bars. A lot of them have live music and if you want a quiet relaxing evening away from the madding crowds of Pattaya and the mainland this is a great place to be. I woke up quite early the next morning, albeit with a slight headache, and the breakfast that's included in the price of the room is served next to the swimming pool. It is a set breakfast, so that's normally not my favourite. You have a choice of a Western set or an Asian set. Actually, the quality was well above average, I have to say that. Freshly cooked and brought to your table. Some delicious croissants, I don't know where they get those from. And the coffee is really first class. 
and even looking at the fruit selection there are one or two different things look no pineapple to go with the watermelon it was really quite delicious so that is 24 hours on Kolan and what did you think about this hotel leave me a comment down below more than 3,000 baht for one night but the room is absolutely wonderful the breakfast was nice as well and staying on Kolan overnight it does have a different feel a different vibe but if this is not the place for you on Kolan have a look at one of these videos where I tell you the seven best beaches on Kolan but for me see you next time bye bye for now oh bye bye say bye bye oh and you <laughs> <laughs>